We're back for part two of the entire DVD collection as of 2021. So let's begin right away. Hate this, the and Tyler. I'm so pissed at these two movies. I think this shop had censored. This movie's just weird, in my opinion. R.I.P. and Asner. And Don Rickles like the first two Toy Story. That movie's worse, in my opinion. This one's a former rental of somewhere. Classic and one for film. They never released Song of the South on DVD. And this rabbit reminds me of Toy Bonnie as well. I always try to fix DVDs following the instruction, but I ended up breaking it, so I need to get a better copy of it. <sighs> Nobody cares about these movies. I like the first Incredibles. Not. A BBC film, I mean, show. BBC show, published under Warner Bros. Reprinted from 2018. Did not show VCI. Because from Britain. Um. A classic comedy, in my opinion. So you can show the deeds. <sighs> I really hate weeaboos. Cause these discs. Oh, you know, Rocket is TVMA. And Princess Tutu is TV 14. It's a 14A or an 18 And an 18A probably. There's a possibility. Tom's taking Shin DVD. Don't get Tyler started with Thomas. My only Thomas PC game. Full screen copy. Oh, why? A uh, Hebrew version of Sesame Street. Yeah, it's actually a Jew Jewish tradition. But if you, but if you hate the this show, I can handle your opinion. <sighs> Fuck Sesame. I don't know what happened, but Sesame Street is just straight up work. Was does not show Warner Brothers, and even though there's a DVD. Ugh! I hate World War. If you actually hate 
well, I haven't done the opening to these three, but I couldn't because copyright infringement. Fuck. Ugh. Leapfrog's not boring when it, when growing up, but I can handle Christian's opinion. Ugh! Screw Sesame Street! <sighs> Still popular, but my opinion... But... Why Sesame Street? The only movie I... That's good. Has something that's good. But it's just cringe. A bit cringy. My opinion went down on the backyard again. If you like this show, I can handle your opinion. I have the other copy in bad condition, but this one's in better condition. Ah, fuck you, Gabba Gabba. You still like this, but fuck it. Ugh. At least Blue Screws is still good. But, I haven't talked to you about Blue's Clues and you. Ugh. Ugh. Bob the Builder? Yeah. I can handle Tyler's opinion on Bob the Builder. Ugh. Disgusting. Ugh. How about that, you bunny? How about that, bunny fuck? <sighs> Shut sure called Max and Ruby that. Because I hate this show. Muppet Show is still great. In my opinion. The Muppet Show is a classic. And I really love it. But if any of those who hates the Muppets, I can handle your opinion. Two thousand DVD of the Muppet movie, not the reprint from Disney. A reprint from two thousand six, Muppets from Space. This is on full screen side. <sighs> <sighs> Now I'm afraid of Bu- Now Bugs is gonna fear me because he blocked Lady Hawk the original opening to Lady Hawk worldwide because he's working under DMCA Oh, probably But, uh, well, he's not actually working King because he's the mascot of Warner Brothers Uh Ugh! Blake ruined that fuck, Blake! <sighs> Looney Tunes is still a classic, by the way. And I still like it. If you hate Looney Tunes, I can have your opinion. Ugh. I haven't been through exercises yet. Yeah. The Wiggles is kind of annoying. It ruined the Beatles. My opinion went down on the Wiggles now. Oh, but days. But I can handle anyone's opinion who likes the Wiggles. What the shit? Blu-ray collection. Who the hell puts? It's great to be ghost. Put that shit back. Stop, Blue Ray! Oh. <sighs> I cares about that movie, especially Tyler. Or in Canada for the first movie. 18A, 18A for the second and third. 14A for third, third, unrated for bonus.
Yeah. If you like the Lego movie, I can handle your opinion. The songs are annoying, and it's like, it's overrated. Uh, yep, a funny Christmas movie. <sighs> Magic School Bus complete series. This disc is broken. I haven't told you why. Because I don't want to get 15 minute mark. I will do a full version once I get a phone and a job. Uh, all right, Muppet, the mummy's boring, except for Scorpion King. <laughs> full screen copy of both of them. So yeah, full screen copy of Doctor Doolittle wanted to. Mario and Sonic Phantasm has a wide full screen copy. I have a wide screen copy. Yeah. Hang on a second. There's one DVD I forgot to put into here. Back in the collection. Bear with me for a moment, would you kindly? I forgot. I forgot where my sisters put Labyrinth on DVD. But, uh, yeah. Really, this is a better version than, and, uh, Who Framed Roger Rabbit? A film by Terry Gilliam. A Dimension Pictures film co produced with Metro Goldwyn Mayer. I will get more good eats. With Alton Brown. Crazy food show, eh? Funny. Lord of the Rings collection. And I do hope to get Hobbits. Third one, not that great in my... Um, uh, including Return of the King. Yeah. I do want to do the opening to this one. Uh, I never listened to Hamilton ever. My sister is obsessed. Um, CD collection. I'm not going to include these CDs because it's for the other collection. There, Slabberth! BBC show published on the Warner Brothers. A genius product film, entertainment film, co produced with Bob and RHI. A content co produced with BBC. And I do hope to get more Monty Python Flying Circus. A Columbia Pictures film co-produced with Playboy. A uh, play, uh, and uh, handmade films. Yeah. A Universal Pictures film co-produced with handmade film. No offering logos. That's all right. Here's the last one for the collection. As of 2021, Born Grey VeggieTales disc. Ugh, new VeggieTales. 
Okay, thank you all so much for watching, and please be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you in my next video.